Welcome from the Argentine capital, Buenos Aires. We are at the El Monumental, the home of River Plate. And our live game is Argentina against Uruguay. I'm Peter Drury and it's a pleasure to be alongside Jim Begley. Hi everyone and thanks Peter, it's great to be on board. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Well, I'm going to say the Uruguayan Cavani. His willingness to put so much effort in is why he scores so many goals. And that also translates to his defensive work in pressing, chasing and tackling. It's all there from him. Yeah, the easiest way to make a difference is to score, so no argument there. Bilia lobs it in gently. Fence has got rid of that. And he has been fouled there. It's not taken him long, and that's going to be a booking. <laughs> Dibachelis. Bilia. Alvaro Pereira gets into the right position to intercept. Plays it into the channel. Played it out wide, but the less said about that pass, the better. Midway through the first half, and there's an impotence about this game that's causing me concern and, and probably most of the stadium too. Let's just hope that by the end, it'll have been forgotten. Oh, good interception. Bilia played out to the right. Higuain pings it out wide. Now it's Higuain. He's in! And the finish! Goal! Argentina! And it's Argentina in front! Look, there just wasn't much of a gap to begin with, and to find it, I think it was a fine drive, and I don't think the keeper could have really planned for that. I think he's a bit unlucky in that instance. Argentina get themselves into the lead. Still a fragile lead though, but they can't afford to sit on this. Boots it upfield. Higuain with the ball through. Alvaro Pereira tries to get it forward quickly. And the through ball is intercepted. And it's Di Maria. Towering header! No, not the best of headers. Bilia. So they got the only goal to give them a 1 0 lead. Di Maria. Looks like a good ball through. Now it's Iguain. Who's going to make this theirs? There is the half time whistle. Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to go in with the lead at half time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Argentina happy to have the lead in a tight old game. Half time, 1 0. Well, 1 0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. 
and it's Messi. Tries a through ball. Higuain beats the offside trap. Plenty waiting in the middle. Turns and goes back. Hits it! Spoon forward. Dumichelis does well there. Alert. Luis Suarez. Uruguay have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. Quartes. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, it's a natural instinct to defend when ahead, but it's too early for them to settle into that practice just now. Tries lifting it over. Messi and it's Higuain Alvaro Pereira charges in aimed long and direct decent ball great leap it's a loose ball well, there's no point in adopting a conservative attitude now. As long as they don't lose their shape completely, they have to throw men forward in this situation. Thrust towards the front line. Now it's Higuain. Di Maria. Going full steam ahead down the left flank. Behind for a corner kick. Clears it out of harm's way. Now it's messy. Nicely controlled. And back out it comes. And the referee brings it to a close. Terrific.